what if the very roof meant to protect an empire could betray it? To solve this, place a board on four pillars. That's a roof protecting you from wind and rain. But flat roofs collect water, leading to leaks, so you added central pillars, creating a sloped roof for rain runoff. That's the basic gable roof. But such a simple roof can sway, even collapse in strong winds, so you added more support pillars. But so many pillars cramped space, so you shortened interior pillars, placing them on beams to transfer roof weight down. This is a raised beam structure. But rain might blow in from the sides, so you extended side pillars, adding a roof on top. That's the traditional Chinese Shaisan roof. Add another eave below the Shaisan roof, and congrats, you've designed a double eaved Shaisan roof like Tiananmen. The double eave Shaisan roof is among the second highest roof style. Its upper roof is Shaisan, its lower eave extend. It combines Rudian solemnity with 